Hi, my name is Allison and I'm the one who put together your cookie kit. I wanted to give you a couple notes, especially about the royal icing. Um, it keeps pretty well, so if you're not going to use this kit right away, that's fine. I do recommend putting the icing in the freezer. Um, it'll just help prevent separation. If the frosting does separate a little bit, it's totally fine. You just need to smoosh it together with your fingers a little before using it. Uh, I think because otherwise it gets a little wonky. Um, now these are tipless bags and they're super handy because you don't have to have all the pieces. Um, and so when you're ready, just take a scissors and make a really small cut right at the tip. Um, you can always make it bigger. So I would start small, test it out, and then if you need to cut a little bit more, do so. But I wouldn't start with a large cut um, at the beginning. Uh, the idea behind decorating cookies with royal icing is to sort of outline the cookie first, trying not to get completely close to the edge um, to avoid the icing from sort of falling off. And then once you've outlined either the whole cookie or the shape that you want to be a specific color, um, then using a little bit more pressure, and I like to hold mine kind of like this using my palm, um, fill in the cookie or the shape. And what I really like are all the fun, different things you can do with multiple colors and using a toothpick. Um, so in one of my example videos, it shows how to make like a zigzag chevron pattern. So by making stripes of different colors and then dragging the toothpick through. So I hope you enjoy. Thanks. 